What would you do if you saw a dog suffering? You'd help. We all would. We're British and we're animal lovers. So how is it that our government has been ignoring the abuse of thousands of animals every year? In the UK in 2015, 4,600 scientific procedures were carried out on dogs to test commercial products. 8,400 horses, 209 cats and 5,500 pigs all experienced the same treatment, with some animals subjected to genetic alteration. And there are problems in the meat industry that you don't have to be a vegetarian to care about. I think it's disgraceful that in 2017, the National Farmers Union estimated that 20,000 live sheep were transported from the UK to substandard abattoirs in Europe, meaning a journey of almost 60 hours in trucks with failed water tanks and ventilation systems. And when they arrive at the abattoir, they face untold misery and suffering. It's also estimated that 80,000 dogs are sold from puppy farms every year a practice that mass breeds dogs and leaves them in dark, dirty and substandard conditions. Dog fighting is still a huge problem. Factory farming is leaving animals to suffer in cramped conditions and the veal trade see calves practically unable to move. My name is Anne-Marie Waters and I'm the leader of the For Britain movement. Our party, For Britain, proposes a comprehensive animal welfare policy that will end animal suffering. We propose banning all unstunned slaughter, that's kosher and halal, to stop animals experiencing unnecessary suffering in abattoirs. We also propose a public inquiry into the certification of halal products to find out exactly where that money is going. We will repeal the EU's religious exemptions to laws designed to protect animals prior to slaughter. We intend to campaign to end animal testing, end factory farming and crack down on puppy farms and dog fighting to stand up for the decent majority who care about animals. We don't have to be vegetarians to care. Let's stand up for those who can't stand up for themselves. Join our movement for Britain and help us fight back. Become a member today at forbritain.uk join or donate at forbritain.uk donate. Thank you.